Yo, what is up? What is going on, all you beautiful people over on the Doom Clan channel? My name is Zach, or Mortal Resistance, but you guys can call me Doom Immortal. I hope you guys are having an awesome day, and if not, maybe this video can make your day a little bit better. Today, we are bringing you guys another awesome Call of Duty Advanced Warfare gameplay. Today, you guys are watching a double DNA bomb playing some solo domination on the map Riot. Now, this gameplay is by one of our newer pub stompers. His name is Doom Mez, aka Mesmertize. He's a beast player, you guys. He sort of just popped up out of nowhere. He was like, hey, you guys, I got all these DNA bombs. You guys think I can have a shot in Doom? And we were like, heck yes, you can. So he's a newer member, guys. Please, since he is a newer member, go and show him that Doom Clan love you guys have been showing to all of our other awesome pub stompers. Do it again here with Mez. Guys, go and check out his channel as well as his Twitter. You guys can find both of those links down at the top of the description below. And like I said, he is playing some solo domination on the map, Riot. And I was reading some of the comments on my past few commentaries here on the Doom Clan channel. It seems like a lot of you guys don't like Riot, but uh, in my opinion, I think it's a really good map. It's very fast-paced, and it's uh, really entertaining to watch some gameplays like this double DNA bomb on this map. So, uh, you just can see within this gameplay, he is using the HBR A3 Assault Rifle, which I think is kind of surprising, you know, I did not expect the HBR to be one of the main weapons within this game for, especially, especially for double DNA bombs, you know, uh, I think a lot of the DNA bombs, double DNA bombs that we've posted here on the Doom channel have consisted of players using the HBR within the gameplay, which I think is pretty cool, you know, I definitely did not expect this gun to be the main gun to go for when going for double DNA bombs, I expect, I expected it to be more so the, uh, the ball or maybe the AK-12, or maybe even the KF-5 on certain maps, but uh, I think it's interesting, you know, I like the fact that there's some gun variety within this game, and I think it makes for even more fun and fast-paced gameplays for you guys to watch. So, with that being said, I do hope you guys enjoy the gameplay in the background, guys. Be sure to go ahead and check out Doom Mez. Like I said, links can be found at the top of the description down below, and let's move on into today's commentary top. So today, guys, I figured I'd talk about, you know, how, how Call of Duty has changed over time, but also how the players have changed over time. You know, back in MW3 when the very first secret kill streak was uh, was in a game you know the Moab obviously the 25 gun streak a lot of people, you know, found that a big challenge. A lot of people found that like, oh, you know, that's that big feat if you accomplish that. You are a really, really good player. And over time, we've sort of just here on the YouTube community, at least, or in the gameplay community, pub stomping community, whatever you'd like to call it, uh, we've sort of just blown up the Moab gameplay standards. You know, a lot of these big YouTubers are like, you know, hey guys, I'm posting this single Moab today. And everyone's like, oh, that's awesome. This guy is a beast player. But now, you know, like we look at Moabs and we kind of expect a gameplay to be a triple Moab or a quad Moab or a penta Moab. It's, it's crazy. And over time, you know, I'm pretty sure at the beginning of MW3 when people first found out that there was a Moab, I don't think a double Moab or a triple Moab and especially a quad or penta Moab was ever something that people figured was possible. And I think it's crazy that now, only a few weeks into the lifespan of Advanced Warfare, people are already dropping double DNA bombs and I'm sure sooner or later we're going to be seeing some triple DNA bombs and once later into the lifespan I'm sure we're going to be seeing some quad DNA bombs and I don't know, maybe even a penta, which would be absolutely crazy, but it's, it's interesting to see, you know, as Call of Duty's have grown over time, obviously we went from the, the Moab in MW3, or even considering the nuke in MW2, but the Moab in MW3 moved on to the nuclear metal in Black Ops 2, to the chem strike or the KEM strike in Call of Duty Ghosts. It's interesting to see how the players have sort of adapted over time, especially some of the beast pub stompers that we have here uh, in the Doom team. You know, we started off getting like some single and double Moabs, posting those to our channel, and now we're sitting here posting pentas or triple nuclears, or you know, as you guys are watching today, a double DNA bomb, only a few few weeks into the lifespan of a brand new Call of Duty, which I think is just crazy, you know, how the players have gotten so much better over time at going for these crazy good gameplays. I don't know, kind of a random commentary topic for today, uh, but I do want to wrap things up really quickly by saying, you know, I just think it's a cool aspect of the game. Let me know what you guys think of it down in the comments below, and I do want to quickly mention that if you guys have not already checked out DoomClan.tv, it's our website made by one of our uh, awesome, awesome designers. Uh, it's really, really awesome. You guys can go and check out the roster here. A lot of our live streamers can be seen over there. You guys can see which live streamers are online and which live streamers are offline. You can check out their entire Twitch page from on that website and it's really really cool. So if you guys want to go ahead and check that out, the link can be found in the description below. Like I said earlier, DoomClan.tv and it is just really awesome. If you guys want to have like your own DoomClan avatars that have the our awesome D, you know the, the D, am I right? Am I right? With uh, the I support DoomClan on it. You guys can download that from that website and it's just a really cool place. If you guys want to hang out, uh, a lot of our members are going to be 
going to be interacting there and it's just a cool place to go and chill so hopefully you guys will go and check that out and that is pretty much going to do it for this video i do hope you guys enjoyed it in the description below you guys can find the links to both mesmerite's channel and twitter as well as mine if you guys enjoyed the commentary but more importantly guys please 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 go and check out mez uh he's a beast player and since he's one of our newer pub stompers definitely show him that doom clan love that you guys have been killing it with over the past few videos and that is pretty much going to do it for this video i do hope you guys enjoyed if you guys did be sure to leave a like rating before you click off this video it is always appreciated by everyone here at the doom team and if you choose to do so i'll high five you in the face and if you guys have not already, be sure to hit that subscribe button here on the Doom channel as well as our players' channels uh, so you guys can catch all the awesome Call of Duty Advanced Warfare pub stomping gameplays, class setups, all types of things like that in the future. And that's going to do it for this video. I do hope you guys enjoyed, and I will catch you guys in my next commentary here on the Doom Clan channel. Have an awesome rest of your day. Stay happy, stay positive, and I will catch you guys later. Peace out. Friendly Manticore incoming. Friendly UAV above.